Otro video party hoy este es Ron con y de inetcomputers.com. The weather is brilliant, but the American proverbial bull noise pollution is not. It's supposed to get up to 80 degrees today. Wow, perfect, excellent weather. You just can't. I digress back to this blasphemy. <laughs> I'm not religious. Thank fucking God I'm not religious. Religion to me is wretched. Have you ever noticed in America the Christians are the ones that try to cram down their religion down your throat without you asking? All right. Poker stars. Oh, my fucking God. Dog. Sirius. Lucifer. Eastern star. Morning star. Where's the revolution? Somebody's poker star app doesn't work anymore. Oh, fuck. We better start a revolution now. Here is the error. When I log into poker stars, I get the message. Rational update or client software has stopped working. This customer had a Dell Vostro with Windows 7 operating system. I mean, I just cannot believe the weather is just so immaculate. It's just perfect. Don't fuck with it. Don't spray shit into the air. I mean, click on the link in the description box down below that will take you to my website, my blog post on my website, anacapiers.com, or you can read the full written instructions. I'm not going to go over all of them. I can't demonstrate. I have no reason to install Poker Stars, but whatever. I think I think you can play it for free on Facebook. I think I used to play it with this clown neighbor of mine. That was about the only game I could stomach. I, I'm just I'm not into the type wasting time fucking around. I've got shit to do. I've got a goddamn revolution to start. I mean, the government and the military needs to be overthrown. I mean. The noise pollution, somebody needs to deal with the goddamn American noise pollution. I mean, all right, so basically what you're going to do is you're going <laughs> to, I'm so bored with these videos. These videos are so boring. It's just capitalism is so fucking wretched and boring and stupid and oppressive. You do the same shit every day. Blah, 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 blah. Somebody's got a problem with poker stars. Oh, well, you, we better call in Aaron and blah, 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 blah. All right, so what you're going to do is you're going to copy a couple of files. Make sure you don't forget to copy these files. You want, you're going to want to copy the user.ini and also notes.user.xml. Those are configuration files with your user settings. It might have billing information. Who knows? I don't use that application. But I am familiar with any files. Those are old school, but they're still being used. And also XML files. So those are going to be files that you want to save because it's for your configuration for poker stars, which is of the utmost importance in America. Don't worry that the government and the military continue to fuck you over and steal your money and the income tax was unconstitutional in 1913 and blah, blah, blah. Don't worry about that crap. We, but you better have your poker stars working. Once you back up those two files to your desktop or wherever you want to save them, then you're going to uninstall poker stars. Go into control panel, programs and features on Windows 7, and then uninstall. Now, I could add additional step. Here's a p potential gold tip. If after you uninstall Poker Stars and then follow the rest of the written instructions and it does not work, I would use my preferred PC optimization tool, which if you click on resources, you will find my preferred PC optimization tool. Sometimes with Windows operating system programs, including Bread's eCircuses programs like games, they don't clean up after themselves very well. And so sometimes running a PC optimization tool, which will clean up temp files, internet cache files, and it'll clean up registry entries, then that program works. But this client, this customer, they didn't have to use a PC optimizer. I just threw that in as a added bonus because I fucking felt like being nice for the first time. After how many videos have I recorded now? Almost a thousand. I think this is the first time I've ever been sincerely nice to you motherfuckers and then now I'm being nasty again
I, I digress back to this importance, this national security. Poker stars does not work. Call in the National Guard. I'm not going to go through the rest. It's real easy. So you copy those files and you can even copy and paste. If you do not know where to look for them, it's under the user profile, app, data, local, poker, stars, user.ini, notes.user.xml, copy the files, then go to control panel, programs and features, bam, uninstall, bam. And then, then you're going to download Poker Stars from the link I include. I included two links in this blog post. One for further instructions if you need further help. And then the second one is the download link when you're going to download Poker Stars again. Then, bam, you download and install a fresh copy of Poker Stars. Bam! Then you click on help because what you're going to do is you're going to recover those two files. You're going to copy them back. So you click on the help icon. Bam! And then it'll take you to open my settings folder. Bam. Then you close Poker Stars. Bam. And then you copy those two files that you save to the desktop or wherever you like to save files alongside your AshleyMadison.com account. You know what I'm saying? If you are asked to overwrite any files, choose accept. Bam. You're done. Bam. You're playing poker. You're participating in Breads and Circuses. You're not overthrowing the evil United States government military that f is fucking up the entire planet and including fucking up your life. Adios! Oh, one more caveat. These instructions were written for specifically, succinctly, Windows 7 and Windows Vista operating systems, but you might be able to use them. The steps aren't going to be the same. Windows XP, you could use these instructions as a basis point if you need to fix poker stars on Windows XP. 8 or 10. Adios. Viva la revolution. <laughs> you fucking gutless coward Americans. You're never going to overthrow this government. You love it.